hello everyone, this is Kimberly here and I am coming to you with another DIY. This video is on a bride and groom wine glass. Now I saw these wine glasses at Hobby Lobby and I think they were running about $29.99. And of course you know I said I can do those or make those myself. So I picked up these wine glasses from Marshalls. They ran $7.99, but of course you can even use Dollar Tree wine glasses. I picked up some bling buttons from Hobby Lobby, as well as different size ribbons from Hobby Lobby. And of course guys, when I pick up items like this, I get them half off on sale. I also used my scissors as well as my glue gun. Now right here, I am just making a loop with the widest piece of ribbon. And I put just the smallest dot of hot glue to hold it in place. And then the next size, I did the same. So next, I am going to put both pieces of this ribbon together by hot gluing, like I did before, just a little dab, the smaller piece to the bigger piece. As simple as that. Next, I'm gonna pinch both ends of this ribbon inward towards the center. And guys, at this point, if you had a piece of thread, a small piece of ribbon, uh, you can tie this together. But I did not have thread or a small piece of ribbon there, so I used what I had. I had a little strip of bling, and I hot glued that bling to the bottom of these two pieces of ribbon. Then guys, I trim the bottom of my loops here. And then I hot glue these loops to my wine glass. Just like this.
and then I take the smallest roll of ribbon and wrap it around the bottom of the loop and the bottom of the thread or in my case the diamond wrap and I'm going to hot glue that ribbon around the bottom of that glass there or the bottom of that ribbon, the loop ribbon. And then after that, I attached my bling button at the bottom there. And here it is, my wine glass. Beautiful in the satin silver with the bling. Isn't it gorgeous? My bride and groom wine glasses. And this did not cost me $30, guys. This ribbon I used throughout some projects that I was working on. And the bling buttons were probably two, three dollars at the most. So I would say probably under $15. Well guys, that is the end of this video. Please like, comment, and share. And if you have not done so, subscribe to the channel where you can become a part of the Diva family. I can also be found on other social media sites, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, as well as Twitter. The links to those social media sites, they will be listed in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. You take care. You be blessed, and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye, guys.